Hi, this is Gabe from FluentForever.com. In this video, I'll show you how to modify your existing pronunciation training so that it tests your spelling by actually asking you to type it in, rather than just think it through. So, I have a copy of the French pronunciation trainer open here, and I want to modify it. The first thing I'm going to do is click Browse and enter Anki's card browser. So, on the bottom left, you can resize this if you can't see everything, you'll find a list of all of your card models. Those are these things with the little triangle thing on the left. The names of these models may change slightly as these trainers progress, but you're basically looking for something that says spellings and sounds. Click it, and you'll see a list of all of the cards that test spelling and sound. They test you on an individual letter combination, like B is for ball, for instance. Um, it will automatically select the first card of, your, of this type in your list, and at this point, you're going to want to click the Cards button. B. This, <laughs> this shows you the code that creates these cards in the first place. We're editing the what's the spelling card, so click on that. Bun. Bun. Then click on the bottom of the front template area. I'm going to click over here, and you'll see that there's a text cursor you can, you can type over here, and it will change what's on the front of the card. So we're going to type a little bit of code. Now, this code is simple, but can be really, really long. I'll show you what, that, what I mean. You'll type curly bracket, curly bracket, type, colon, and type because we, we want to type in the word. It's type. And then here's the long part. You're going to type in the, the name of the thing you're trying to test. Uh, and then you do end curly bracket, end curly bracket. So what is the name of the thing we're trying to test? Well, in this case, we're looking for ball the thing that, that makes this word happen. And the thing that makes this word happen, unfortunately, is super, super, super long. It's example word for that spelling sound combination. So you go type colon example word for that spelling sound combination. And yes, you absolutely can copy and paste that. So I can select this. Just make sure you're not getting the curly brackets, just the text. Example word for that spelling and sound combination and you're pasting that right after the colon. Curly bracket, curly bracket, type, colon, this whole thing. End curly bracket, end curly bracket. Uh, below the video, I'll include something you can copy and paste. Just be careful. Make sure it matches up to what you see right here. Uh, I may well change this name for some of the Asian languages. So just double check and make sure it's exactly the same. So we're done modifying this card, so you can and you can see, basically, it's going to test your spelling here, it's going to test tell you what's right and wrong here, uh, and so we can close this. Uh, now we're going to do the exact same thing for one other card model, for the picture words card model. So you click on picture words, it shows you the list of those, you're going to click on Atlet. cards, you'll click on the what's the spelling card, Atlet. 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 and then over here again, you'll click on the bottom of the front template, Curly bracket, curly bracket, type, colon, example word for that spelling and sound combination, command C to copy, command V to paste, end curly bracket, end curly bracket, and voila, you have this spelling testy thing. Hit close, and that is it. Now you can close out of the browser, and then that will produce exactly what you want it to do. If I hit study now. Orbit. I will see Orbit if I type it wrong or whatever. Orbit. It will show me my mistake. Ta-da! And that is it. I'll see you next time.